My name is McFly. I'm from Sacramento, California. Uh, my style of art is mostly Japanese with like uh, American twist, if I had to put it in a nutshell. I definitely incorporate sneakers into my art because I do a lot of character design and all the characters gotta be the flyest at, every, at any point. Uh, so I moved here to LA about five years ago and I really just stayed focused. Like when you use like apps like Instagram and Twitter, you have to be consistent to stay in, in the eyes of like all the people that's on the internet and like you have to be consistent about what you put out and the, the type of work and quality always has to go up and I had to learn that over time you're just going to get better, you work on your craft and I feel like I can get even better every day. My installation is Sneakertopia. Basically I have three walls. I had to envision in maybe a hundred years from now what, what I think a Back to the Future 4 movie would look like and like how people would dress, the cars, um, how basically how sneakers will be involved in the future. Another installation that I had was I did a, a video game styled mural and I have a few people that I know and a few people that I know that are influential in our sneaker culture and I wanted to just put them in there. I just wanted to highlight certain people that I figure are either coming up or already established. On one side I have Salehi, he's a the head sneaker designer at Versace. I have John Geiger, he's one of, one of my friends and he's an uh, absolutely dope footwear designer and I feel like his new shoes that he's coming out are like really breaking the barrier of, of like people making their own shoes outside of the larger brands. Another installation I have is a wall where it's movie posters and I'm tying popular culture movies that people already know and then I'm doing my own spin on them. A few of the ones that I have are Fight Club and I did one where it's like Flight Club for his gun but it's like his son and he had the Nike Cortez in the old movie. I got him in the Nike Sakai's now. So every movie poster that I chose, I kind of tied up, up something from the past and then something to the future. So I just feel like that's one of my big points in my, all of my art. What I think people can get out of Sneakertopia is the fact that it's not just about sneakers. The shoe itself is about the culture that it brings. Like it brings people together. Everyone has their favorite pair of shoes. And then I feel like when you come to Sneakertopia, you can see the different artists and they're putting their spin on everything and showing a different light about how big this culture is and like how we need a spot like this.